time. The final leg of the American Triple Crown for three-year-olds was run early this morning, Sydney time, the Belmont Stakes. Here's the action. Great. Count Reese will send them on their way, as he's been doing for 10 years. They're off to the Belmont Stakes, and Kiss and Chris on the outside, but now Cherokee run, and pulling the heathers shows some early speed. Raglan Road is right there between horses. Sea Hero up close, Silver of Silver, Antrim Road on the extreme outside. Quick, quick early speed, Antrim Road angles to the rail and takes the lead. And on the inside, that Cherokee run into second position. And then a gap of a length and a half, and Bull in the Heather is racing third. On the inside, Colonial Affair squeezed back a bit as Raglan Road begins to move up. But back on the front end, it's Antrim Road with Richard Migliori showing the way by two and a half lengths, and the horse we thought was going to be in front, Cherokee Run, holds the second spot. Along the outside, there goes Wild Gale, who is moving up quickly. And Sea Hero is asked for some speed and quickly responds. He is now fourth along the inside and looking for some racing room. Down the back stretch, Antrim Road leads it. Wild Gale is second. And now Bailey takes uh, Sea Hero to the outside. And there has been a problem. Prairie Bayou has thrown the rider. Prairie Bayou is riderless on the back stretch. Looks like he has broken a foot. Anyway, they go to the far turn, Antrim Road leads it. And uh, Cherokee Run on the outside is in the second spot. And now there goes Silver of Silver, charging up third in the green cap on the outside at the rail. That's Wild Gale as Sea Hero drops back and Colonial Affair with Julie Crone starts to move out the middle of the racetrack. As they're midway on the turn, Cherokee Run on the outside takes the lead. Antrim Road at the rail is second. Along the outside, that's uh, Silver of Silver. And Julie Crone now angles to the outside from between horses. That's Wild Gale moving up. But now it's still Cherokee Run under a drive with Chris Antley in front. And now here comes Colonial Affair on the outside. At the rail, that's Wild Gale followed by Silver of Silver. And now Colonial Affair with Julie Crone takes command and draws clear. It's Colonial Affair drawing clear in the Belmont with only a furlough. And Chris with a late charge on the outside. Wild Gale at the rail and in the middle of the racetrack. Virginia Rapids, but in deep stretch, it's going to be Colonial Affair winning it by two lengths. Kiss and Chris second, followed by Wild Gale third. After that, it was Silver of Silver and Virginia Rapids. And it is the first time that a female rider has ever won a race of the Triple Crown Series. Well, that was it for racing yesterday. Next week, the big double in Brisbane, the Stradbroke on Saturday, watch out for deposition, and the Brisbane Cup on Monday. And later in the program, of course, our $1,000 bet. Thanks, Max. Yeah, thanks very much, Kenny. Talk to you again next week. And we trust that you've got your feet up, relaxing with us this morning on Wide World of Sports. We'll have more on the other side of this break.